According to local media, the Uzbek Air Force shot down a fleeing Afghan military plane, while Tajikistan stated at least 143 former Afghan soldiers departed the war-torn country in three planes and two helicopters. On Sunday, Uzbekistan's air defense system announced that it shot down an Afghan military plane that was attempting to unlawfully enter its airspace. According to them, the incident took occurred in the country's southeast, in Sirkhandaria, where the country shares a border with Afghanistan. The plane's two pilots survived the crash and were sent to a military hospital in the province of Termez for treatment. Within hours following the publication of this news, the Uzbek Prosecutor's Office issued a statement claiming that the jet crashed with an Uzbek plane that had been assembled to escort it from an airport in Termez, Sirkhandaria. The announcement contradicted prior statements by the Uzbek Defense Ministry, which claimed that Uzbek air defense personnel shot down the Afghan military plane. The whereabouts of the Afghan soldiers and aircraft who were forced to land in the border city of Termez when they first arrived was unknown from the prosecutor's statement. Tajikistan, a former Soviet republic bordering Afghanistan, claimed on Monday that two Afghan military planes carrying more than 100 soldiers were allowed to land in Bokhtar, Tajikistan. On Sunday, the Afghan government fell apart and Taliban insurgents seized control of Kabul. Hundreds of Afghans, including military and local police, are said to have fled to neighboring Central Asian countries in recent weeks as Taliban forces gained authority in a number of districts, particularly around the northern border regions.